What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. If you like this content, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Today is a... I don't know. So far, it's a chill day. I ran a couple errands today, and like I found an um, external hard drive, so I was just sitting here uploading my YouTube videos to my external hard drive and kind of just doing some research. Um, my last MacBook ended up basically like already slow it started slowing down even more and i ended up getting a new macbook but i was trying to do some research to kind of figure out how i can avoid that in the future it's like impossible to store all your content on your computer and edit especially when you have like especially when you have content um across multiple videos so like sometimes if i have like a vlog going i'll upload it and i'll start editing it but then i'll have like some type of standalone video that I want to also upload during the week so then I'll have that content on my laptop and it's kind of like impossible to store everything at one time so trying to figure that out also like I said got a new external hard drive and was having a hard time trying to set that up so had to do some research around that and yeah right now I'm about to buy a couple things from Sephora because I still have a gift card from Christmas I've been wanting to use it but I haven't wanted to use it on like Things that I would normally buy, like skincare that I, you know, routinely use. I wanted to kind of like try something different with my gift card. So, yeah, I found some things to buy. So I'm going to go ahead and order that. And I'm very excited about that. I'll share it when I get it. But hopefully I like the products. Um, but I'm starting to kind of like build my spring skincare routine, not just for my face, but also like for my body. Cause like during the springtime, I usually use more like oils and lighter moisturizers versus like using body butters. And um, sometimes I do use body butters, but primarily I don't really use like my shea butter and things like that um, in the spring and summertime. So I have quite a few things that I want to purchase because um, I like to switch up like my scents in the house. I like to switch up my body scents. I like to switch up my body wash, my soaps, all that type of stuff. So let's see what time is it. So in a little bit, it'll be time to go get Miss Myla from daycare. I actually think Deshaun is going to pick her up today, um, so that'll be good. And then I don't know what we're going to get into for the weekend. It was a pretty sunny day, and now... It looks like the sky is starting to gray. Um, it is supposed to be a rainy weekend, I think, so who knows what we'll get into. But like when people ask me how my weekend was, it's like my weekends are always good, thank God, because I'm off work. Like I'm doing what I want to do. I'm not like going into work or like logging into my laptop for eight, nine hours a day. So yeah, I'm excited about the weekend. Wanted to show y'all. So these carrots, when I put them in my fridge, I have to figure out how to store carrots in my fridge without them getting soft. And I think I just looked it up on Google, but I found out that if you put your carrots in cold water and just stick them in the fridge for, these probably have been in the fridge for about two hours, um, but I think you can leave them in. So they're already hard actually, but I think you should leave them in for at least about like three hours or so. Um, it will get your carrots back hard. It's not that your carrots are old or anything when you um, when they start to get soft, but I don't know what happens, but they get soft. And I am going ahead and making her sweet potatoes. I'm gonna combine, she loves sweet potatoes. I'm gonna combine sweet potatoes and carrots this time, I think last week I did butternut squash and carrots. So do that. And then like I said, at some point this week, I will probably get her some new things to try. But yeah, if you have any questions about how I actually prep her baby food, I have it in one of my vlogs. Um, I can link it down below. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Like, it's pretty simple. I pretty much just boil everything really soft and use my Vitamix to mix it up. I learned my lesson with green beans because the first time I made her green beans, I actually had to throw them away because I prepped it the same way I made her other food. Yeah, I mixed it up with way too much formula and the consistency was terrible. Like, it was so bad. So, and 
I'm thinking about cleaning out my closet this weekend. It's pretty warm in Atlanta and I don't think we're quite ready for spring yet, but it is getting warmer. And so before the spring actually hits, I like to go ahead and put away my big, thick sweaters and pants and scarves and stuff like that. Because now that next week is March, I pretty much have a feeling that I'm not gonna need those things. And so anyways, I just need to do an inventory of everything that I have and then start purchasing um, the things that I need. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and finish making her food and then figure out what the next move is. Um, I have a meeting in about an hour, so I guess I'll start getting ready for that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It feels so good in here. Like, this is what I love about the spring and summer. Like, I'm the type of person that likes to have my windows open and the air on and the fan on like i don't know to me it's just like a good combination and i got a plug in in and it just smells so good in here um and it's a rainy day so as y'all i love my earrings they're like little spiral earrings from ring concierge and i absolutely love them but y'all my hair gets caught on them all the time like every time i turn around I'm trying to figure out how to get my curl out of the daggone earring. I had to get my mom to help me put them on, but I love these earrings. I obviously cannot take them on and off because of how hard they are to get on. But, y'all, they stay getting caught. Like, oh my gosh, that is so annoying. While I'm sitting here snacking and watching YouTube, these bark things, y'all, oh my gosh, like... Um, they're so good, but so bad because I literally can eat a whole bag in one day. It's so bad. I literally just got these today and I'm about to snack on them. And by the time I turn around, he's going to be gone. Not bad on the sugar for candy because it's 12 grams of sugar per serving, which of course you should only eat like four and a half, five of these and not eat like so many at one time. But these are so good. And I always get the dark chocolate pretzel and sea salt. I think one time I tried the almond ones and I didn't really like them. But um, I'm a dark chocolate type of girl. One thing about me, I freaking love chocolate. When I was younger, I used to love milk chocolate. But now I really hate milk chocolate. It tastes so nasty to me. Like, you can dip. Like, it tastes so sugary. But dark chocolate is always just, like, so rich. Oh, my gosh. It's so good. Um... But yeah. So yeah, I'm about to snack on these, finish watching YouTube, and wait on Deshaun and Myla to get home. So yeah, I said it. I like that though. I can't mess that up. Super interesting. Mm -hmm. These are very nice. Yeah. It's hard to open it. It would be very nice if it was a, um these are nice things. It would be nice if these were um dresses. Mm-hmm. Fair enough, because this is nice to put in her room. Yeah, She'll like nice. that and take naps in it too. And play. And you can close it once you take a nap. What's up y'all happy sunday today i am going to edit a youtube video i'm gonna try to get it published today um yeah i'm gonna try to get it published today because usually i work on my videos throughout the week but this week i haven't done that so yeah i'm gonna be starting i'm gonna be starting to edit a new video today and i'm gonna try to get it published today we'll see 
But I ordered a few things from Amazon and mainly just things that I want to use to organize my car because like I was telling y'all, my car was so dirty. I got it clean on the inside. Um, yeah, but this is not car related. I got this from Amazon. These little hand little scrunchies so that when I'm doing my skincare, the water isn't like dripping down my arm. Blame TikTok, honestly. I, I got most of these things because of TikTok. Like I was just looking through videos um, to see what I could get from Amazon that would help me organize my car. Um, and let's see. So got some more masks. Never have enough masks, especially the disposable kind. Um, I got some spray for um, my screens for <clears throat> my MacBook and my car screen. Um, so this is just like a spray and a little squeegee type thing. I can also use this on my phone and iPad and all the other things. Also got some cup holders. Let's see, what's this? Oh, I also got a document holder for um, my like car registration. And I also like to put like my last service, like when they do like a health check on my car, I like to also save that. So I have this, cause right now, Y'all, my glove compartment, I still have like the same stuff that was in there when I bought the car, like the manuals and like all of that stuff is still in there. And I bought my car, I think like three or four years ago. So anyways, got this for that. That's all I got from Amazon right now. I have some more things coming in next week. So I'll probably show y'all those things when they come in. Um... I also got like a little mini trash can for my car because um, like at, we already collect trash in our car like from receipts and like taking back packages and stuff. But then, um, so I think I'm going to go grab breakfast, go grab a coffee, do a grocery pickup, then come home and let's see, we're probably gonna FaceTime my grandparents today so that they can see Myla and we can chat. And then I'm just gonna edit my video. We may run a couple errands. It's gonna be a busy Sunday. Like I'm pretty much gonna be moving around most of today except for when I'm editing my video. So anyways, that's that. I will catch you all in the next clip. Good morning, y'all. I am headed into the office. Got my Starbucks. And yeah. 45 minute commute to get to work is insane, actually. It was a journey getting here, but I had to stop by Starbucks because to me, it just kind of feels like an incentive. Like I could eat breakfast at home. Um, and sometimes I do bring my lunch because I don't like to eat lunch at work. Like I don't like to eat the food at work. I also got some egg bites. The brown sugar oat milk latte with only two pumps of brown sugar syrup because last time I got um, three pumps and it's way too sweet. Like so, the thing about Starbucks is sometimes like I feel like I don't taste coffee enough. Like that's my that's my problem with Starbucks. I feel like sometimes it's too much milk and too much sugar and not enough like actual coffee. So this is pretty solid though. This has I think like two pumps of espresso. So this is pretty good, but I don't know. Sometimes they coffee just do not be doing it. Like other times they mess up like the caramel macchiatos. Like, and then last night, like Myla. So the night before last, for the first time, Myla woke up at like five o'clock, ready to play. And we were like, "Girl, what's going on?" Like, she has never done that. Like even as a newborn, she would pretty much just eat and go back to bed. Like we've never had her wake up too early. Like she. She's pretty solid when it comes to her sleep. She went to sleep at like 7 o'clock, which is 30 minutes later than she usually does. And she still was up at 5 o'clock trying to play. May I have an uh, 8 count chicken nugget meal? Chicken nugget meal for the drink? Um, sweet tea. Sweet tea. Alright. Anything else? Can I have um, Chick fil A, Polynesian, and honey mustard sauce? Chick fil A, yay, yay. 
Huh, I don't even really like Chick-fil-A. I, I don't know why I constantly eat things that I don't really like just out of convenience. Like, that's why I got chicken nuggets because I was getting um, Chick-fil-A sandwiches and the way that chicken was not done completely in the middle, first time that happened to me, I was like, no way. This is not for me. I feel like every time something get really popping, like Chick-fil-A been around forever, but every time something get really, really popping, like the quality just go down. And anytime it's a long line at Chick-fil-A, which it really wasn't a line today, but anytime it's a long line, I'm not even trying to go because that means they pushing food out the window and your order may not be that good. I did have some chicken nuggets last week and they were actually good. Like they were actually cooked really good. Um... I think overall I'm kind of just grossed out by chicken, but when it comes to fast food, I just feel like for some reason Chick-fil-A is like, you know, like it's a few steps above like McDonald's and all that type of stuff. Which I do Chick-fil-A, but I really, I don't really want it, but I am going to eat it. Yep. And it's lunchtime, and as y'all can see, I'm not at the office because your girl left early today. And I'm just gonna take the rest of my meetings from home. I'm behind them. Jade. Thank you. I love Atlanta. Atlanta is so black. Like, these are my nails. This is how they turned out which not too bad. I'm still growing them out. I want them to be a little longer, but I am happy that these are my natural nails. And look at my slippers. I love these. I also talked about these in my last month's uh, monthly favorites, but I absolutely love these slippers and I can't wait to get another pair. The color that I want is out of stock, but once they come back in stock, I'm definitely going to get them. Also, real quick, let me show y'all because I feel like I'm always buying something. Um, I got a few things from Sephora. That I had a gift card. All right. Got a few things from Sephora for the spring months that are coming, which I'm so excited about. All right, so... First thing that I got, this is just something I need to re-up on, but I got this jelly cleanser. I use this to take off my makeup and it works really well. Um, I don't know if I got a smaller size or if the packaging just changed, but this is definitely smaller than the one that I have in my shower. But anyways, this is the Ren um, Jelly Oil Cleanser and yeah, this is good for makeup and like when you're wearing um, mascara and stuff, it gets it off really good. I also got this lip glow balm from Laneige and I actually really love this brand. I have their lip sleeping mask and I use it. I've been using it for years and if y'all can't tell when I really like something like I use it all the time and I use it throughout time. But anyways, I got the lip sleeping mask. People were raving about this balm so I was like, let me try it. It's the same brand. and. Honestly, if it's like the lip sleeping mask in a tube, that's even better because I hate having the tube out and having to stick my finger in it. Plus it's brown, so it doesn't fit in the purse as easily. I also got some of the We or Way products and this is my first time actually opening it. Hmm, it smells good this flavor so this is the body cream and this scent is melrose place and it smells pretty good it smells kind of floral in a way um but i like the scent i like when creams and lotions have like a light scent and honestly in the spring and summertime it is with the oil but i just think it's nice and then in the summertime like you always want to just smell really good you know we got our skin out like i i love all of that so that's that. And then I also got this scalp and body scrub. I was trying to find this at Target. But, oh, I can smell it through this. I was trying to get it from Target. It's the same scent, Melrose Place. Um, but they didn't have it there. 
So I got that. And then last but not least, I also got the body wash. So, and this is Melrose Place as well. So all the same scents and I got the, these in a the sip. So really happy about that. And then this is just a freebie that I got, a balm powder. I thought I had actually, I picked up like three different freebies and I only got one, but whatever. So yeah, that's that. That's what I got from Sephora. And let's see, I also got some things from Amazon. And from Amazon, I got these um, ice trays, which I'm going to be making a lot of iced coffee at home, iced matcha, so wanted to get that. It's not like I don't have a million different um, ice trays. Like, we have two other ones, but I, I like those, the way that one looks. It's pretty cute. Um, I also got Myla some more sweatpants because she needed some, and then... Actually, I think I'll try these on later to let y'all see how they look. But basically, I got two outfits. I got, um, I'll show y'all later. But I got a couple outfits from Amazon. So, that's all I got. Um, I am, I am about to go put that stuff up. Um, Myla is picking up Deshaun, so I need to figure out what we're having for dinner. And before Myla gets home, like, if I'm not picking her up, I always like to kind of prep the house for her to get home. So, basically go ahead and get out her pajamas, get out her school clothes for tomorrow, go ahead and prep her bottles, make sure that she has dinner for when she gets home, get the counter, like, completely cleaned off if it needs to be. Um, and I pretty much just prep the house so that when she comes home, we can play, she can get a nice dinner, we can read, give her a bath, and then that whole process is seamless because everything is already prepared for her to get here. So let me go do all that, um, and then I guess I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Not really much going on today. Um, I posted a vlog last night, so that went live um, late last night. I'll probably do some editing tonight um and then yeah that's about it so i will catch y'all tomorrow i am just getting back from the dentist's office I just stopped by Bojangles because y'all, Bojangles, like, it's not a lot in Georgia, but in North Carolina, Bojangles is like the fast food spot. So anytime I'm on this side of town, um, I like to stop at Bojangles, especially since it's lunchtime, it's literally perfect. Um, so the dentist office that I went to um, is black owned and so freaking nice. Like, you wanna talk about aesthetics? Like, this place had aesthetics down pat and y'all know going to the dentist office is already like not the best experience like I personally don't like nobody playing in my mouth like going to the dentist office and having to have your mouth open for that amount of time to me it's just like it's mad annoying but I love when the experience can be so nice and seamless like basically had no wait time um really good experience and yeah i'm looking forward to going back so now i'm going home i'm literally y'all literally in meetings i've had meetings actually all day and i've missed quite a few due to my appointment but that's all good um but now i literally have meetings from one o'clock until 4 30 um and i won't get home until closer to one o'clock so yeah that's my life um the ladies who worked on my teeth she was the hygienist and she cleaned my teeth she doesn't have any kids so she was like you know learning that like i have a new baby and she was like so what's it like being a mom like is it what you expected and i'm like yeah it's great like the best thing that has happened in my life was definitely having Myla and like having her here like 
it's it's definitely a different type of joy um but i was telling her i was like people always talk about like being tired because your baby isn't sleeping at night and like they're on this crazy sleeping schedule or whatever and like for the most part i think i told y'all like we really haven't dealt with that at all with myla just now she's starting to kind of like go into a little bit of sleep regression which i really think is hitting her late because i think they usually say it happens at the six month mark however she's seven months and now it seems like she's like fighting her sleep a lot more um she's waking up in the middle of the night wanting to play it's like girl it's not really in the middle of the night it's more like at five o'clock in the morning but it's like girl it's five o'clock go back to sleep like we're tired we need another hour like six o'clock i could do six o'clock but five o'clock i ain't trying to do that so um i was like you know a lot of people talk about in the middle of the night having problems you know with their kids sleeping and stuff or their kids sleeping in their bed we don't really have those problems like none of that really bothers us but the thing that really makes you tired is the fact that you literally don't stop like from the time you get up in the morning until the time you go to bed at night you're literally on and even throughout the middle of the night like what's up y'all so i am about to go have lunch with deshaun and I wanted to just do my makeup real quickly on camera before I go. today which should be really good um apparently his job had really good food for black history month too i'm not really surprised because he always talks about how good the chefs are. and yeah i just threw on a little makeup no foundation i kind of should have put on foundation because i have been eating like trash the past week like oh my gosh and it is almost time for um, that time of the month. So I'm not surprised, but my hair, I still have not redone it. So this is, I think now officially a week old hair. Um, and like I said, I always love how my hair looks after a few days. Um, and then this top, I don't even know where this top is from. Um, it was honestly a gift. Um, so I'm not sure, but I love this necklace. I think it's from Lily Class. I got this necklace. Um, I got this necklace, I think last spring sometime. Um, I think I got it last spring and then at one point it had broke and then I sent it in and they replaced it. Well, they re replaced it, they actually fixed it. Um, this necklace, I think, goes out of stock pretty quick. I'm, I may try to grab another one just because I love this so much that if something happened to it, at least I would have a backup. But yeah. And then this necklace was a gift from Deshaun for Valentine's Day in 2021. So yeah, it's my favorite necklace. Um, and then I'm just wearing this watch by Tissit, I think it's a brand, and we just picked this up from the store, really nice watch, um, quality watch. I've had it for a while and it still looks perfectly new. And yeah, 
I'm wearing some jeans. Let's see if I can show y'all my jeans. So my jeans are made well, and I love these jeans. I love how they fit. They're super comfortable. Um, and then I'm likely gonna put on, I think, these brown shoes. That would be really cute with this. And yeah, that's pretty much that. So, um, don't know what we have planned for today, but we will figure it out. I um, still have a couple more meetings left today. So once I get back from lunch with him, I have to come home and finish work. And then once I finish, maybe like around 4.30, we'll figure out what we're getting into. Um, but anyways, this is the end of this week's vlog. I hope you all enjoyed. I don't really know what's gonna be in this week's vlog. Like, I feel like I did a little bit of everything in the vlog. Like, I don't know. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed and I will catch y'all in the next vlog that's going to start tonight. Bye.